Hey, this is John Carlos. Entertainment Earth has sent over to me some really fun novelty items from Archie McPhee that I'd like to review for you guys. Like this big dress-up Bigfoot, this super awesome like Christmas wrapping book, and some really cool Christmas ornaments. We got a Bigfoot ornament, and a Krampus ornament, and we got a Screaming Pickle. Wait, what? Yeah, a Screaming Pickle. Archie McPhee makes some really random stuff. But you know what I think when I see this? I think of myself as like an eight-year-old kid who is like totally amused by stuff like uh, the snakes that pop out of a can, and I see that eight-year-old me like really digging this. Like I would have like snuck this into the kitchen and like put it with a bunch of the other vegetables. And when you push this little face, it screams, <coughs> and it has like a little scream face. And as you can see, it actually does have like a pretty decent pickle sculpt to it. And like they painted it with like different shades of green, so it actually does kind of have that uh, like kind of color texture to it. So that's fun. Um, this may not seem like the obvious Christmas gift, but uh, like for like the little funny goofy kids out there, like the kind of kids who like like little novelty gifts, like uh, snakes in a can, or like the, uh, the the little gun that when you pull it, it snaps on you. Like kids who read Mad Magazine. Like do kids even read Mad Magazine? Like I feel like I just dated myself by saying that. I just showed you how old I am. But if there are kids out there who still read Mad Magazine and like goofy stuff like this, I feel like this is the perfect stocking stuffer for that goofy kid in your life. Next up, we've got this Bigfoot ornament. And I dig this because I dig Bigfoot stuff. And I think as far as like Christmas ornaments goes, I like that this is a little wacky, a little silly. It would look weird on your tree, and I like weird. Also, I like the design of it. There's a very retro, simple design to the way it's sculpted. And uh, I dig the kind of metallic way it looks. There's like a goldish look to it. He's got a goofy, weird looking face. But what I really dig is that the base has these little like painted lines to imply that he's standing on a piece of wood and that the uh, words Bigfoot are kind of painted over it. You have like a dimensional effect there on the bottom. But uh, I dig this one a lot. Next up is the Krampus ornament, which is my favorite thing in the set because I think Krampus is awesome. If you've never heard of Krampus, go look him up online. You will be fascinated. Uh, there's many versions of Krampus throughout uh, like the the history of him, but uh, the traditional one that I know is how he comes to your house. He's the partner of St. Nicholas, and he comes to take away the bad children into the forest. If you're good, you get presents. If you're bad, you get taken away by the little Christmas demon. Uh, I think there's other versions where he you know, comes and leaves switches in your stocking if you're bad, so your parents can beat you. But either way, I love that he's got like the hooved feet, and uh, like the, the actual like design of him with like the his little goat legs and his uh, like torso and demonic head and, and creepy tongue. Like, look at this thing. This is a creepy looking ornament, which is why it's awesome. Uh, I dig the fact that he's got children in his bag. Like, this is such a great ornament to hang on your tree. I love that this thing even exists. Now we'll take a look at Dress Up Bigfoot, who I think is like a cardboard figure, like a 16 inch tall cardboard figure and all these little vinyl decals to like dress them up with. So to get them to stand up, you just pulled back this little middle section and pop those two tabs down. And there you've got your little cardboard Bigfoot. And you can attach like whatever little pieces from this vinyl sheet you want, like uh, these little tidy whities And uh, this maybe a little Santa hat if you want to go like a Christmas festive version. And all these little accessories that you could put on, you know, like uh, with his Hawaiian stuff, you can give him like a little ukulele there. And you can switch up the outfits too. Like if you partake in Oktoberfest, you can dress them up in Lederhosen. Or you can bling them out and give them headphones and shorts. There's all sorts of stuff. You can give them like a watch, some different hats, different shoes, uh, sunglasses. You can be, have a kilt, full Hawaiian outfit, tie. There's a lot of fun accessories with this guy. His legend is real. I know I said the Krampus ornament was my favorite thing in this review, but I changed my mind. This is. Uh, there's some really, really cool wrapping paper in this uh, book here. Now there's a perforated edge, so it's easy to kind of like pull each uh, sheet of wrapping paper out. And you can see there's plenty of it within here. You just sort of pull on that perforated edge. Now Christmas wrapping paper can be so boring sometimes, which is why I like this. You got Hot Rod Santa. You've got this awesome set of uh, the classic Universal Horror Monsters. You've got uh, Santa as a cent centaur. Uh, which is so random, but I love it. Um, you got fruitcake. You've got this ugly Christmas sweater with uh, like unicorns and Bigfoot on it. You've got more Bigfoot, but there's a few of the little white Yeti mixed in there. So that's pretty fun. You've also got Christmas bacon. This, I personally have received this before 
true story, and I loved it when I got it as a wrapping paper. Like, I almost didn't want to unwrap the package because I really, really love this. So I'm glad this is included in this set because awesome. Again, it's Universal Monsters. And if you're into Universal Monsters, like, this is awesome wrapping paper. Again, there's so much like just like red or like snowman, but this is kind of unique and different. You've got, <laughs> it's like the Screaming Pickle. There's a Christmas Pickle here. And you've got Krampus. All sorts of twisted Krampus and the kids being taken away and burned. This is awesome. Awesome wrapping paper. I really dig this one. You've got Bah Humbug if you're not really into Christmas and you're stuck giving gifts to someone. You got the Santar again. I really dig this. Uh, if you're, you know, wrapping gifts for someone that is unique and funny or you yourself do not want to use the usual kind of boring wrapping paper, this is an awesome idea. Thanks to Entertainment Earth for providing all these items for me to review for you guys. Now, if you like any of the items you've seen here, you can not only buy them on EntertainmentEarth.com, but you can follow the links that I provide in the video description below. If you click on those links and buy them through that link, you support my partnership with Entertainment Earth. So, thanks for watching. <laughs>